everybody, welcome back to Colouring Care. Today I'm going to do something a bit different. Um, I've just recently come across a YouTuber called The Influenced Colourist. She's got a few videos up and her, her colouring just looks amazing. But she has started this tag and it's um, five colouring books in quarantine tag. Um, and it's basically um, a few questions, five books that you've um, recently got in quarantine, what you're working on at the minute, um, what you'd like to start working on, um, and a little bit of a chat. And then in the description of my video, I will tag some other colourists to um, join in. And I'll also put links into the um, in the description of the page, people that I've tagged and um, the influence colorist as well so that you can go and check out her YouTube channel. So I'm going to start off first. These are books that I've recently got whilst I've been in isolation and we'll start with the Hannah Carlson book. I was really excited to get this book and I have coloured one image in it so far but I just thought it's a really nice one to have while I was stuck at home. This one is a smaller size than Rovers, so they are easier, um, quicker to colour. They don't take up as much time. Um, so I did this one. Really enjoyed that. If you've seen my April's finished pages, you'll have already seen these. So I'm not going to um, go on for too long. But yeah, I, the next one I would like to do like a double page spread like this is my next one. I'm hoping I can do that this month. So that is my intention to do maybe not this one, but maybe another double page spread. This one's quite a nice one as well. This little party going on here. So yeah, that's the first book. The second book is this one and it's Botanicum by Maria Trolley. And I have started one in this. I've not done much so far, but I am planning on completing this one tonight. But the really sweet images. Oh, this is the one. And this is the image that I've started. For some reason, I really like colouring cherries. <laughs> I don't know why, for whatever reason. But yeah, so this is the one I've started. I would like to start this one. Are these peaches? Uh, peaches or plums that would be quite nice I've not coloured anything like that yet it would be nice practice so maybe that would be the next one that I want to do in this one so that's the second book that I've got in quarantine Botanicum by Maria Trolla the third one is another Maria Trolla book this is a new artist to me and I've really enjoyed um, when I received this Dream Race book I really really enjoyed the images in it so that's what made me go on to purchase the Botanicum so this is the third book of quarantine and I have done a couple of images in this if again if you've seen my April's completed pages you will have seen these but I'll try and find them again There's beautiful beautiful little images in here that was it and this one was done as part of another hashtag this one was one Woodland Wonders was it called by Vicky so that was a little cute one and um, my most recent one's in the beginning which was that one if I am to colour another one out of this this month whilst stuck in quarantine it is probably going to be another one with a black background I think it was near the front actually a little garland there I really want to start this one. Um, I've got some a few ideas of what colour palette I want to do. I want to try and go for something different um, and use a colour palette that I, I normally wouldn't. So I'm going to have a little look through my colours and see if I can plan something. But yeah, I really want to do this one in this book next. So that was the third choice. Um, the fourth choice is more of a drawing. I know it says colouring books, but... Um, I have really enjoyed it. This is the only other new book that I've bought whilst in quarantine as well. So this one's a little tutorial by Camilla Derricourt and it's a step-by-step -step, um, 
showing you how to draw basically so yeah so i got that and i have done the first three tutorials in it which you've probably seen if you follow me on instagram this is a little print by um camilla derrico i haven't drawn that i'm not that good yet but yeah this was the first one i did this was the second and this was the third my little fuzz bot is so cute so my intentions is to do the next tutorial and i'll show you which one that is i think it might be that bad girl yeah so i've just done the fuzz bot so the next one i want to do is moonbeam and mates card and it's a little sweet little bat bat girl and this is the final so hopefully you'll see that um in the next couple of weeks from me this is what i intend to do next so that's the fourth book with my little sketchbook um the fifth i haven't purchased this whilst in quarantine but i have um i have completed a page in here i'm not going to show it because it's part of a body color um and my body hasn't completed hers yet but what i will show you in this book is the next page that i intend to do if i can find it without um showing the body here whoop nearly <laughs> um that's one that i did a while ago and i double page spread they're really fun these kirby pages so you can just throw everything at them throw loads of color at them it doesn't matter does it can be what colors you want this one i really want to i really want to do this one um to have a practice with my water um mainly this one's appealing to me as well but i'm not i'm not really good at making things look like metal or brass or so that would be a um a good one to practice on maybe but yeah i'm gonna do this one so yeah that is my five um i have worked on a couple of other things whilst in um quarantine but there's two two many to show but i will show this one this one's out of camilla derrico's pop manga coloring book and this one i did as a tribute to our nhs in the uk because we've all been putting our rainbows in our window so th so this was my tribute um to the nhs and the rainbow of hope for when we come out the other side and i loved i love i love doing that one so that's it so they're my five books beautiful beautiful books i will pop the links in the description i will pop my tags who i'm tagging in the description if you don't want to join in and i've tagged you that's fa absolutely fine you don't have to it's just a bit of fun um don't feel obliged um and i will pop the link into the influenced colorists page um she's the one who started this tag off and of course if you just want to um do your own start your own and tag some people that's fine so i hope you're all holding up i hope you're not getting too bored i hope you're staying positive and just getting by the best you can um stay safe everyone please subscribe to my channel give it a thumbs up and drop me a comment it really does help and i appreciate every one of you thanks for watching see you again soon Bye bye